How's it going everybody? Rocky Man AC here and today I have another video for you guys. This time I'm going to be applying these Flytanium Titanium Lotus Scales for the Spyderco Paramilitary 2 on my standard stock PM2. Now I already have part of the knife here disassembled and we're gonna go ahead and um, add these scales to it. So we have this locking portion, which Flytanium makes a very nice um, handle design. Everything always fits really nice. And then we're gonna add just this side here, Put the blade in there, get everything lined up. Get these tightened down. Now, Flytanium makes a lot of different handle materials for um, a lot of different knives, especially the PM2. Um, they have carbon fiber um, in these Lotus versions. They also have um, micarta versions as well. And they offer um, even different styles of the titanium on there as well. So there we have this side done on that titanium finish. And now we're gonna go ahead and add the other side to this. Now this uh, pocket clip here, I believe takes T6. Yep, so that works. I always recommend a really good bit driver anytime you're taking apart um, a knife, especially a knife you really care about because stripping screws is not a fun process and it is not something you wanna have to deal with. So that's very nice. Keep all of that intact. I like to try to keep all of those components there. Go ahead and take our normal Eight here. I do have some Loctite on there. Take that off. Take this. Now, I know a lot of people say that the PM2 is difficult to uh, disassemble and reassemble. However, um, it just kind of depends, honestly, um, kind of what you're using and what you're doing. Really the hardest part is that barrel spacer. I've found it's not too difficult. I haven't damaged um, my G10 or anything like that. So I've really not had any issues with uh, assembling and disassembling this knife here. So have the other side here on, just putting on the body screws. And honestly, this is really looking uh, really nice. Um, I do like that G10, but I think in terms of just looks and feel this is something a little different uh to the pm2 that is nice uh to add onto your knife and the action is just beautiful oh my gosh feels so good super smooth feels like a somewhat different knife 
Um, very interesting um, on the feel for that. But Flytanium makes a lot of excellent handle materials for a lot of different knives, including the PM2. So I highly recommend that you check them out. Um, Flytanium makes very nice materials uh, for knives. So if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Rocky Mountain EDC channel. Thanks for watching.